Fantastic. Good afternoon. So for the last 200 years, we've been automating jobs that are dangerous, dirty, and dull. But unlike this picture, for some reason it hasn't happened to work at heights. And this is the problem. Window cleaning hasn't changed since window cleaning was invented. And I can tell you that was a long time ago. This video was taken in the 1930s. And this picture, today. When you look at this picture, you see 10 guys that are risking their life to clean windows. I see 10 people, each of which were trained for 3,216 hours. That's like an engineering diploma. And why? Because of safety. So we're Skyline Robotics, and our vision is to automate all types of work at heights. You see, starting perhaps with the most prevalent reason, window cleaning. And before you ask, we're not a hardware company. We don't develop rigs and machines and robots. We're a software company, or RAS, Robotics as a Service Company. You see, we develop the brain, assembled from off-the-shelf parts. These arms were designed for the factory floor, a stable, well-defined, and predictable environment. We are taking them to the outdoors, to the unknown, placing them on a pendulum hanging hundreds of feet in the air, exposed to wind and weather and, well, people putting their heads out the window. So what's innovative? What you can't see. The brain, Osmo, running the lift, rig, and robot as one. Our machine learning algorithms are able to take these existing infrastructures and turn them into a giant robot. And I'll explain why. You see, any time a person steps into a rig and is elevated, that person is at risk. And it comes at great public danger with massive insurance and liability implications. And you know what? In 2018, it simply doesn't make sense. So how much better is Osmo? Well, let's look at a 40-floor building. A 40-floor building takes today three people, 480 hours, that's two months of work, to clean. With Osmo and just one person, in those same eight months, we can do eight, uh, two months, we can do eight buildings. That's an 8x efficiency increase, and we do it at a third of the cost. Let's look at some numbers. Sorry, let's look at competitors. So we're not operating in a vacuum. For the last 30 years, lots of different machines have been developed to mechanize window cleaning. But the reason they haven't entered the market is because window cleaning is binary. It's either clean or dirty. And if it's not 100% clean, it's dirty. And these, these giant car wash brushes simply don't get the job done. Why are we different? Because we're imitating the human arm. Literally, we have the same dexterity, mobility, and uh, uh, responsiveness as a human would have. Let's look at some numbers. The window cleaning industry thinks that 8% profit is OK. This is the norm. This means $800 million from a $10 billion pie. At Skyline, we work with window cleaning companies, help them grow from 8 to 60% profitability. And these low margins are similar to all types of maintenance work. Think snow and ice removal, painting, masonry. And that's just real estate. What about the maritime and aerospace industries? We are changing these economics completely. But how do we go to market? So there are more than 10,000 window cleaning companies in the United States. But 60 of them are servicing 40% of the market. We're already in touch with the top 15. And we have working agreements with two of the top 10. We haven't stopped there. Through our personal and investor network, we've reached out to building owners and have agreements in Texas, Florida, and New York. How are we doing this? Our team. Our team is awesome. From my co-founder, Avi, who's been developing robotic systems for the last decade, to Alex, who's been heading uh, computer vision teams at Intel, Neil, head of lifting rig compliance, Shani, heading our R&D operations, to Ohad, software developer turned mechanical engineer, and myself, who's just really lucky to lead this amazing team. Traction. We incorporated just a year ago. And since then, recruited our core team, completed beta testing, and secured our first paying clients in the United States. Funding, we've recently closed a $3 million seed round, which I'm extremely excited about. And one of our lead investors, Karcher, is right here in the, in the crowd. Thank you for that. <laughs> um, so as you've heard me speaking here for roughly five minutes, I'd like to leave you with one thought. Right? Think of your building your building, the one you work in, your friend's building. Now think of how it's cleaned. 
And when I get off this stage, I'd like you to come to me. Either give me your business card, or let's sit down for a coffee, because we're here to do business. And we want to clean that building. Thank you. <laughs>